Hey guys, uh, right now I'm going to be testing uh, Trend Micro Titanium Maximum Security. Uh, it's downloading currently and it's uh, 532, or uh, sorry, 53.2 megabytes in size. And whenever you download it off the internet, it's only 2.35 megabytes, but then it has to download off the website, so. Hopefully this will work because I tried multiple ones before. I said I was going to test, uh, just, let's see, I was going to test F-Secure and Microsoft Security Essentials, but I'm going to leave that Microsoft Security Essentials till it gets out of the beta mode, and then I'm going to also test F-Secure some other time because it had trouble downloading for me for some reason. It wouldn't work, so. Uh, yeah, so basically I'm just going to let this install and uh, I'll be back with you guys in a few minutes so I'll see you then okay guys I'm back and uh, right here as you uh, just first install welcome to trend micro titanium maximum security never click an update button again so uh, it automatically keeps you up to date which most antiviruses do um, right now I'm just on a 30 day free trial for the um, just for the um, Test, but as you can see, tools you got parental controls, data theft prevention, trend micro vault, and the security eraser. These are all just default, but I'm just going to turn on. Um, wait, let's see. Yeah, see, I'll just leave this on default because you need to do uh, make an account for them and all that stuff. So. Um, you're protected, you have the latest access to the latest protection. Yeah, okay. So let's just quickly run into. Let's see here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, about five processes. Um, 85 megs there. 86, 87, 88, about 88, 89 in that area. A little big, but uh, yeah. Okay, so let's get started with the test. And you get a little toolbar right here, page rating. So I'm guessing if we go to Google and type in something to search, it'll rate this website. Let's see. Yeah, as you can see right there, sort of like Norton does. So, there we go. Um, block by Trend Micro. And there we go. And right now, I'm just going to tell you this video is going to be in HD like all my other videos, so um, just be sure to watch it in full screen in HD. This one is a Trojan. Uh oh. Hang on, let me disable my Norton one second. Okay, it should be good now. Hang on, let me disable this, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back, sorry about that. Um, okay, I got it working now. This one might actually got it through. Yeah, that one got through. And it looks like actually... Disabled the virus protector.
Well, this is crap because it's not even starting back up. But I can see the processes in there, so. Well, it's still there, but obviously there's still a virus in there, so let's continue with the test. Uh, this one looks like a Trojan. That one was blocked. That one's blocked. So, three for four. Trojan here. Uh, four for five. That one's dead. Um, five for six. Six for seven. Seven for eight. Pretty good so far, only missed that one, but that one could cause your computer to... I don't know, it might have actually terminated itself. Looks like 8 for 9. And I'll get 2 more. Nine for ten, and one more. Let's see. Just try this. And yeah, so basically that one's blocked too. So it only missed one, and I'm going to run a full scan with Trend Micro, but first I'm not gonna see something in here. I don't know. Okay. Geez, that's a good bit of uh, temp files for just using that for one time. So, okay, let's run a full scan. So it's got 10, 10 out of 11 because I know I did 11. So I'm going to scan. Geez, this scans pretty fast then. That couldn't have been a full scan. Okay. So, I'm going to let this scan and I'll be right back and I'll talk to you guys then. Alrighty guys, I'm back and uh, right now the scan just completed and it found nothing, so... Uh, basically, nothing found anything. Norton Power Eraser, nothing. Hitman Pro found nothing. And I'm still waiting for malware bytes, so. But I basically think that was maybe in a temporary internet file, and it just, uh. It basically just got caught and then. or deleted, rather. So. It might actually be gone off the system. Um, next scan I might be doing, uh, I mean, next test I might be doing a Vera free version. Then I have a few requests that I'll get done.
as soon as possible. So. Yeah, basically, I'm just going to let this finish, and then I'll be back with you guys in a few seconds. Alrighty, guys, I'm back, and uh, right now it's finished, and found nothing. So, I don't know, maybe it was just a freak thing just to make something happen one time or something. But uh, right now, I'd give it a 10 out of 10, or 9.5 out of 10, because it really didn't miss anything. Except that one, but I'm not sure what it was, because it's not getting detected anywhere in here, so... Yeah, basically 10 out of 10. Um, next test coming up is Avira, uh, the free edition. And uh, I guess I'll catch you guys in. And uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. If you guys have any requests, just feel free to private message me or uh, post a comment somewhere. Um, yeah, just post a comment or whatever you feel like doing. Okay, then. I guess I'll see you guys later. Have a nice day.